what makes Zambia, Zambia very special? The <laughs> fact that Zambia holds one of the seven wonders Yay. of the world, yep. Victoria Falls. What inspires my designs are um, the texture of the material, the color palette of the material. When I look at photography, that inspires me. When I listen to a particular music, that inspires me. So such elements, put these things together, they inspire what I do create. I love boy stuff. I'm into the men's, men's wear. wear. When you look at what our parents used to wear a long time ago, it's very much different from what we are wearing today. African beauty is the, it's the diverse culture that we all share. In Southern Africa, we're dark-skinned. In Western Africa, they've got an accent. In Northern Africa, they're light-skinned. You can never define the beauty of Africa. It's, it's just simply beautiful as a continent. This is a Zambian terrine, and this is traditional Zambian, it's 100% vegetarian. But when you taste it, it actually tastes like meat. The first meal I remember eating the village chicken with chihuahua, that's um, pumpkin leaves. Pumpkin leaves, uh, which they prepare with uh, ground nuts. My grandma cooked it, it was amazing. I grew up in my grandmother's house and she used to tell me a lot of stories about the past. I bring that in my music because I tell most of, most of the stories that I sing are reality issues, things that are positive, things that people go through. I've always loved traditional music which is ethnic music. So that music has nurtured my writing into something very real and uh, typical tradition. What makes me Zambian? Hmm. <laughs> I don't know. What makes me Zambian is my heritage. I've always loved the traditions and customs of Zambia. It has to be the people. I mean, land uh, without people is barren, but Zambian people are loving, they're caring, they're free, they like they're fun, you hug all the time. It's the people, definitely. <laughs>